Hello. So this is your review for uh, WWF Wrestling Challenge, nine, January the 19th, 1992. Um, just a, a couple of side notes regarding this show. Um, this was recorded way before 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 January the 19th. Um, so this aired on the same day as the Royal Rumble. So there's there's things in the show that I will go through that um didn't happen basically at the rumble. So uh yeah. We without giving too much away. Um yeah, there's a couple of things I just need to mention about this. So opening match was the macho man Randy Savage, now a a, a face, taking on um Hercules. Um uh, Macho Man won this with the lovely, beautiful elbow, flying elbow from the top rope. It's a thing of beauty. It's just wonderful. And he got the free, and this eventually turned out to be Hercules' last uh, syndicated televised match for, for the World Wrestling Federation. So, same really, because he was, he was, he was good, to a degree. Um, but in the eighties, obviously he had he was like one of the Bob the Bobby builders, and but he lost his way in the early nineties, I think, and then they decided that was that, and away he went into the the annals of time. So I don't I don't remember him popping up in anywhere else in like in a prominent role. I think he might have popped up in a few like indies and stuff like people do, but yeah. So that's how that match was. Sadly, he's passed away now. Um, the next match was Dusty. And we mind writing. <laughs> Dusty Days taking on the British Bulldog, David Boy Smith. And um, the Bulldog won via pin after the running power slam. Um, not really much to say here, except that David Boy won, really. There's not really much else to say. But as I've said before, Superstars Wrestling Challenge. Um, Power Hour main event generally in those days were squash matches mainly. It it was the odd one or two like Savage and Hercules where you would have like two full roster members fight each other or rest each other as it were. But yeah, so that's where that's what happened in that match. So yeah, Bulldog won. Um the next match was a tag team match. So the is a non-title tag team match as the World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions. And they were called Legion of Doom at this point. Um, because, um, I don't know, they just were. Um, that was Hawk and Animal, obviously, for those uninitiated. And they took on, this is where it gets a bit odd. They took on Brian Donahue and some unknown bloke because he, they didn't say his name at all. So I don't know who he was. And obviously Hawk and Animal won quite quickly with the Doomsday device from the top rope. And of course that meant they were heading into that night's, inverted commas, Royal Rumble. My hair, man. All over the shop. Where they were going to defend the tag titles against the natural disasters. And we'll see how that plays out. The next match was also the main event of the, the show, which tells you all you need to know about this show. That it was a main event of the tag match between the Nasty Boys and uh, Larry Sampson and Bobby Jones. Yes. And the Nasty Boys won, obviously, as, as they would do at this point. During the match, the commentators were saying, oh, what happens if knobs and sags meet off in the rumble? Are they going to start fighting? Well, we will never find the answer to that because Nobbs never appeared in the Rumble and there's a reason why he never appeared. Oh, people always ask why Brian Nobbs wasn't in the 1992 Royal Rumble and I'll, I'll tell you why. Because outside of a show, I don't know when, but this was before, obviously before the Rumble, um, somebody decided to stab him. So, yeah. So Nobbs was stabbed and obviously didn't take part in the Rumble. Hence why the Nasty Boys never fought each other in the Rumble. So there we are. Exciting, eh? And you just thought stabbing in wrestling was just sort of Mexican wrestlers. And like Puerto Rico. Oops. Didn't say that. Oop. Sorry. 
Sorry, I, I, I didn't stab him. I was just here. I was in the dressing room. <laughs> and if you want to know more about that, I don't know, ask someone. I'm not getting involved in that sort of shenanigans. But yeah, so that was January the 19th, 1992. As I said, <coughs> yeah, well, yeah, wasn't wasn't great. But And that, of course, will now lead into the Royal Rumble of 1992. So we shall see if it's as good as I remember it, because I've always said this is the it's the low it's the load most loaded rumble I've ever seen. If you, if you go back and watch it, you'll realise how loaded it is with with future fall of hamers and people that win titles here, there and everywhere. It's an amazing rumble. Um and it's probably one of the be better rumbles of, of ever. Really, I th I still think it's up there. A lot of people would say like I think somebody told me two thousand one, two thousand two were good, but I still say ninety two Rumble was the best one. But that's just my opinion because I was brought up in that era, so I have I have a soft spot for that Rumble. And and side note, um, for years I di I didn't have Sky for years. I didn't get Sky until like ninety nine, so I never watched. Um, WWF really until like the videos came out now obviously now with the network you can just watch anything within like the last month's Raw and Smackdown 30 days ahead so in those days you never Raw and Smackdown was never really shown in Sky for years and they started showing it mid 90s I think as they started showing and it wasn't really live as such as it is like Raw and Smackdown and it's TR now we're very privileged to have that now. Because in those days we didn't have live Raw and SmackDown. We had to... And the internet was like in its early embryonic stages. So like now, basically just put the word wrestling into Google. It'll come up with the latest results. <laughs> so it does. I've tried it. <laughs> I wouldn't try anything else putting into Google though. Because it might cause a problem in the household. And do it kids so yeah um my point being that um as i said i didn't get the i didn't get sky until 99 which means i came in october 99 which was around that time they were building up to survivor series 99 that's when i came in but i, I had watched it pre to that i didn't watch it for years because i didn't have sky and because the videos because i was in jersey then the videos were um, not quick. They didn't come out like every month. There was there was no need because the, the pay per views were only like they only had four in those days, so they were like every what two three months, if that, sometimes longer. So yeah, the the first video I probably ever bought wrestling pay per view wise was probably the Rumble ninety three. The amount of times I watched that over the years watching that Rumble, I've seen it about twenty times. And I still think that the person that won it, <laughs> I'm not going to say that now, but the person that won it, I still think he's going to lose. <laughs> I know. I know it's not possible, but still, there we are. But yeah, so I watched, I watched the videos then, and yeah, we're, we're blessed now. We're, we're really blessed. So when people complain about what they see on, on Raw and SmackDown, and Teen Dynamite and Rampage and such like, um, and Impact, uh, <laughs> Hey ho, it's your opinion. Your opinion's wrong, but it's your opinion. Um, so yeah, good times, good times. So yeah, that's a quick video. Um, I will be obviously reviewing the Rumble at, at some point, if and when I get to it. Um, but yeah, for now, I'll see you all at ringside. Remember, just just remember one thing, kids. I'm always the best in the business at whatever I do. Eating, I'm brilliant at. I'm fantastic at eating. Not drinking, brilliant at that. And here's a question for everyone. So it's November or Movember, so you need to grow a moustache. Now, obviously, I can't grow a moustache because I've already got one with a massive beard. So my question to everyone is, do you want to see this gone? Should I do it the opposite way? I could do Shovember, which is shave it off. It's, it's a work in progress. It didn't really work. Tell me what you think and tell me if you think that when dry January or whatever comes up, I should do drunk January. 
because I don't drink. All your all your questions on a postcard. Thank you very much. My name's Will. You've been wonderful. See you soon.